good morning. No, it has not been a good morning. Mm. You of all people should know <laughs> it has not been a good morning. Well, that's why I said it like that. I woke you up twice. Yes, you did. Mm -hmm. And I and Mom woke me up once. It was a really nice night for me. How'd she wake you up? Um, With the she, ding dong thing? Yeah. Well, she actually called me. Oh. Because I didn't hear the ding dong thing. Yeah. Well. She called me, and of course, the phone rang, and it was her. But there's no. Once you pick it up, there's nothing. Her phone yeah. is a mess. Yeah. <clears throat> Our service here is a mess. Our next door neighbor is painting their house purple. I just thought everybody should see that. Not that I'm unhappy with it, but it's, you know, it's purple. <laughs> That's what the owner wanted. I know. They can do that. You know, you do you. You can have a purple house. Uh -huh. They want a purple house, let them have a purple house. Should we paint ours pink then? Sure. With great big yellow dots on it? Sure. There you go. So anyway, I am not going back into my room until Kevin moves everything, fills any holes that are open, vacuums, tears my bed apart, vacuums my mattress and everything in there that you can possibly think of and puts it all back together and puts clean sheets and a blanket on my bed. Wow. It's going to be a long time before you can get into your bed. I'll sleep right here. <laughs> I'll sleep right. I'll go sleep in your room. Oh, okay. Yeah. I don't know how much better it is in my room, but... I don't know, but we have mice, okay? <laughs> Y'all know that. We have mice. Squirrels. We have squirrels, okay? Yes, we do. Nora's not a good mouser, <laughs> okay? She catches them and plays with them and then lets them go, okay? She's not a good mouser. Kevin won't let me get any more cats. <laughs> so... We have all these mice. There was one in my room the other night. Was going from this nightstand across the wall uh, behind my bed to this nightstand. Nora would climb over me to this one, climb over me to that one. Okay? Nora got stuck under the one nightstand. I had to pick the nightstand up so she could get out. <laughs> so, this is all leading up to the fact that Yesterday, we found a tick in my bed. In my bed. Kevin was able to get it out. I didn't think anything more of it. Yeah. I sure thought more of it. Because I was in bed, and I decided to get up about 3, 3.30 to shower. Because I wasn't sleeping. <laughs> I take a shower and I'm rinsing myself off and I go like this and I feel something right here. Like, what the heck? I thought maybe it was just a clump of hair, so I go in like this and it wasn't coming off, so I look. There was a tick embedded in my boob. Mm. <laughs> it was in bed with me. I have no idea how long it was in there. And... Uh, I'm freaked out. Now, I have agoraphobia and I don't like leaving the house. Now I don't want to be in the house. <laughs> and it's not just the fleas on, I mean, the ticks on the dog. It could be on the squirrels. It could be on the mice. It could come in on... on Freckles. <clears throat> it could come in on Ivy. Mm. I don't know. Because Ivy sleeps with me every night. So I don't know. I don't know. I'm not happy. I am extremely unhappy. Kevin is going on a mouse hunt today. 
<laughs> and um, we're hunting mouse. <laughs> During that mouse hunt... I'm going full Tom and Jerry today. <laughs> Take Nora with you. <laughs> um, during that mouse hunt, he's going to take care of my room because I seriously am not sleeping in that room. Seriously, I'm not sleeping in that room. Okay. I'm t that's the... That... I can handle snakes. Not a problem. Don't give me creepy crawly bugs. Don't give me creepy crawly bugs that are going to stick their head inside of me and suck my blood. That's a no. <laughs> a hard no. So, anyway. That was my morning. And I'm sicker than a dog right now. And we don't know if it's medication, food... I, I don't know. I'm just so sick to my stomach right now. So, how are you guys? <laughs> well, I'm fine. You should ask me how I'm doing. I'm doing great. Except someone keeps waking me up in the middle of the night. But, uh, yeah. I wake it's up crying day. hysterically. It's a pretty day. I have it's him nice check my warm. entire body for ticks, and he goes back to bed, and I'm still crying. What am I supposed to I'm exhausted. You're killing me. <sighs> Hose you down with Raid or something. I don't know what to do. I don't do. think Raid takes care of ticks. Uh, well. It freaked me out. That's all I have to say. Okay. I've been on this corner of this couch since like 3.30, 4 o'clock this morning. Right here. And Ivy keeps wanting to go outside. Not that she's going outside to go to the bathroom. She's just going outside. Did you ever see the horror film Tick? Oh, yes. <laughs> go there with me. We ought, to, we ought to fire that one up and see, you know, maybe we could learn something. You ain't getting me to watch <laughs> Nope, I'm already freaked out enough. Thank Alrighty. you very much. Ivy's going upstairs. Okay. So. All right, guys. If I'm alive, I'll catch you guys later. <laughs> so today, I am trying to seal holes. It's the best I can do for right now um, to start um, dealing with the, uh, the mouse issue that we have. More uh, of an issue with uh, um, ticks. Apparently, they're bringing ticks into the house, and we can't have that. We have animals, and uh, one was on Val, so I'm going to start up in her area. Uh, they are probably coming in here through the kitchen. There's a large opening behind the stove, so that's where I'm going to start. Uh, there are other holes like this. Not so much trouble, but I need to fill them um, and uh, just work them by. So, here's my plan for this. First of all, this is the outlet for the uh, range right here. Uh, I turned that off already. I need to move it. <coughs> I'm going to probably just move it over here somewhere. It'll still be in the close enough proximity to plug it in just to get it out of this area. Um, I moved a, a box over to here. This is the wire to the range. This is 220, and mice have been chewing at it, so I'm going to cover that as much as I can. And this is not going to be in the wall. It's going to be over here, hopefully uh, with uh, no more issues with mice. So I'm going to build a 2x4 box frame around this and um, 
put a piece of I don't I'm thinking that the drywall would make more sense than uh, uh, a piece of plywood just because I it seems to me that um, mice don't chew through drywall I think it's poisonous to them uh, so move that out of the way build a box there's going to be one opening coming out of the side of the box that needs to be dealt with and uh, otherwise it'll be completely sealed so this will not be a main thoroughfare for mices anymore all up, uh, put a piece of drywall on it, to, of course using screws so if I need to get into there I could just pop that right back off. Uh, steel wool around the pipe, uh, no gaps that I can see so uh, I'm going to clean this up and that's it for me today. I've made such a mess. <sighs> 